Hey YouTubers, Scott here. For a little while now, I've been frustrated every time we take our caravan, trailer if you want, in the US, uh, out, have to uh, hook up a set of uh, accessory mirrors onto the outside of our mirrors so that we can see down behind us and around the side of the van. Excuse the traffic noise. So, I got a little bit fed up with it and researched what mirrors are available that you can just put on and leave on. And I know you can get good ones that cost over $500 for a pair. You can also get ones from China that cost $300 a pair. So, let's have a go at putting them on and see what they come out like. So the first thing you have to do, obviously, is to get the old mirror off. You can see there's nothing on the outside there to show you how to get it off. They're also uh, electrically controlled for up, down and sideways, so there's going to be wires involved. So I suspect we're going to have things underneath here. Yep, there we are. Yeah, sorry about that. Managed to hit the button without meaning to. Um, so, uh, you can see here we've got one, two, three nuts to take off. Um, this one here is just to hold it in place while you get the nuts started so it doesn't fall down on you. But then you've got this one here which is your electrical and that goes down in here. off um, yeah so we're gonna have to take yeah in order to get down to there we're gonna have to take the whole door card off so that means first thing up is going to be taking this handle off okay so I'll just pop this little cover off here onto that for a minute. Let's see what's under these two bad boys. Okay, a couple more screws. And let's pause you until the uh, garbage man goes past. Okay, garbage man's gone. Okay, so we've got a few more things that need to come off. There's uh, now, let's see, yeah. these little round things with the little dot in the middle. Uh, apparently, they're a real bastard to get out, but. I'll give it a go. And down under there, we've got another three screws that need to come out. Alright, I'll get them out and I'll come back when I've got the door card off. And just a quick tip when you've got these little ones here that Toyota like to use uh, on the Land Cruiser, it looks like there's no way to get the little button out to then lift it out. You don't get the button out, you just push it in one more click. And that releases it and out she comes and then if I can just get somewhere without too much sunlight there okay all you then do is you just push him 
Yeah, that way. Push it back through. Right. And that takes a little thing out of the middle there so that it's not locked anymore as well. And you can put him back in and then click, click, and then she's locked. All right, cool. Okay, so just so that you don't get caught like I did, just be aware there's one hiding under there, which is where your uh, up and down control for the uh, for the window is. Okay. Okay. Just a little tip to get the um, the little cover off from behind here. It's got a hole up there, a hole up there. You just have to get a screwdriver in and pop them out like that, and then it comes out over the top of the handle. Okay. So the door trim's off didn't destroy anything which is amazing for me and you can see how it slips off over the top of these handles and the fact that um, there's a little knob on there you can see just a screwdriver in there and lever it up and that pops off so from the uh, mirror you can see the wire just goes down and clips in there and on this replacement mirror see it's just got the same kind of uh, connector so uh, yeah we'll get that disconnected get the mirror off okay there you go Got it out without completely destroying it, which is good. Let's see what size are they? 10 mil? Right, back in two seconds. Okay, 10 mil. Ooh, surprisingly not very tight. Not tight at all, I'd say. So hopefully, a little wiggle, and then get it out. All right, so I suggest you don't lose the original mirror, because that's going to be worth an awful lot of money to someone somewhere along the line. So uh, yeah, whack that up on eBay, or save it until you sell the car, whichever. Okay, so one thing that you'll notice about the new mirror is the fitment. They've got studs coming out of them and a little packet of nuts to go on there. So let's see if we can get it all in. So I've got the top one in to hold it and actually go in super easy, which is great. Okay, well, that was pretty painless. Now this, I haven't broken it, so it should just clip straight back in around behind there. Bit of a bugger to get to.
so it's a little bit more difficult to do it leaning over the top of the camera I've got to say all right I'll do that while you guys are not watching make it a little bit easier on myself but that should just clip straight in uh, back to front yep there we go clip straight in okay so before we go any further Let's give it a bit of a go. I'll go and hop in the driver's seat and we'll see if we can make a move in and out and up and down. Right, there's out, in, up, and down. I can hear the motor moving. Okay, well, that all seemed to work pretty well. So, uh, yeah. Um, right, I'm going to turn the camera off to put everything back together because you don't need to see the reverse. Uh, it's exactly the same as taking it all out. So, yeah, talk to you in a minute. Okay, so there it is all back together. Let's see about my adjustments. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. And then, of course, you've got the bottom bit, which is a uh, manual adjustment for that. And, yeah, all right. So, now I've got to do the driver's side. And I'm going to do the driver's side without filming it. You've already seen. It's, uh, it's just exactly the same thing, just some of the things are reversed back to front. So, let's, um, let's get this one done and uh, we'll come back and have a look and see how that one looks. Okay, so trip down to the uh, shops was fine and now I've reversed up to the caravan and uh, I think I can see pretty well past that. Not too bad at all. Uh, that's with an extended obviously. The same on the other side there, I can see well past the van. Yeah, okay, I'm pretty happy. Yeah. So these are the mirrors that I bought uh, off eBay, obviously, um, from, what is it, MLA Autosports, or sorry, ZMA Autosports, and that's how much it cost. All right, thank you, and uh, yeah, subscribe to the channel for uh, new videos.